Okay, so let's have a little look at some of your Divine Masculines. Ooh, look at that. King of Cups, Queen of Pentacles. Some of your Divine Masculines are... Hang on a minute. Look, what's just... Look at that. That was in the middle of the deck. Just turned upright on its own. Well, that's a very good start to a reading, isn't it? The King of Cups, the Queen of Pentacles, and then you see the Ten of Cups. Beautiful. Let's have a little look. Some of your masculines. Masculinos. The masculinos aren't talk. Oh my gosh. Are not talking to us. Shall we have a little look why? What's going on? If you've got your Divine Masculine, haven't spoken to them for a little while, let's have a little look what's going on inside their head. What? Let's have a look. All right. Angels, spirits. Gods, gods, the highest high. Let's see what's going on with this masculine. Why is ten of pentacles? Why is saying he's working on his money, working on building his little empire? That's what I just heard. Why is this masculine no contacting? Being oh my god, is it gonna be another one of them motherfucking readings that we had yesterday where it's all just like, everything is gonna be wonderful, don't panic. Um, all right, I put that one down. Uh, okay, so he's working on his pentacles. What else is our divine masculine who is moving in silence? What is this chap doing? Our divine, oh, ooh, he's flirty. Okay, full. He's working on taking a chance. There's that king of cups on the bottom as well. Perhaps working on finding a way to sit within uh, his more emotional aspects. What else is this masculine doing, please, spirit? What's our masculines up to? The ones that are quiet at the moment. This isn't for the ones of you that are talking to your masculine. You know, this one is the one he's been quiet for a moment. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. Three, three, and a three. You got three threes there, baby. The bottom of the pack was the six of... Uh, why did I just start saying the six? Okay, the bottom of the pack was the three of swords, okay? And the three of swords talks about heartache. Okay, so he's, he's trying to heal at the moment. He's feeling very burdened at the moment. I feel the reason why he's quiet is because he wants to take this new... He wants to move in. He wants to move in. He wants to move in. He wants to move forward with you. But again, there's those feelings of worthiness. So we do see this, you know, there's, there's heartbreak that he's having to heal. There's trauma that he's having to heal because he doesn't want to bring these burdens to your doorstep, as it were. I am seeing um, the dismantling, possibly, of a third party situation here with the three of cups and the three of pentacles together in reverse. I feel a little bit like this is this is related to this heartache and this uh, burden is that he's having to leave a third party situation before he can take this, this leap with you. Um, but he's also working a little bit, I think, on, I mean, yeah, look. You know, working a little bit on um, healing himself having and creating an empire, as I said. So he has something to give to you when he comes. Um, working on his offer here, okay? This offer of love. This emotional new beginning. But this is something that's going to be stable. This is something that he's imagining at the moment. But I feel like this is going to be turned into something that is stable and realistic. And underneath that, we had temperance as well so this is bringing healing in to this situation um i do feel a little bit like he's not happy where he is at this current moment of time which is obviously you know creating this um scenario but once he removes himself from this karmic relationship and puts these burdens down and does the healing that you know gets a little bit more towards his empire is what he's trying to do at the moment a little bit more balance in his life i do feel like he's he's going to be going through and i think he is going through a town moment at this moment in time um possibly to do no i don't think it is that i think i think he's going through a town moment at the time but this hierophant is just representing that this is all through divine timing oh my god uh, 
it's all divine timing because he wants to be able to come with communication and a solid offer of happiness for you and to also be in a very stable position of being the emperor. This is a beautiful reading. Let's have a little look. Let's do some of these. Um, yeah, I, I feel like he's trying to get himself into a stable position. I mean, we shall see. We've got some very positive cards here. I feel like the third party is being removed for this very quiet one. He's working. Oh, soulmate. Your soulmate is already with you in spirit. Believe this and they will manifest. Yeah, he's working on himself at the moment. Can we get any more information? Um, my beloved, though we may be physically apart, spiritually we're always united and love transcends space and time. Nothing is missing. You guys are already in union in the 5D. Uh, you could probably feel him. 555 five, five in the time when I say that. When it comes to matters of the heart, there is no right or wrong. Every choice that you make um, expands your understanding of life and love. When you pass from this world, you take nothing with you but your soul and the memories that you have shared with people that you love. Um, yeah, secret admirer on the bottom of the pack. I feel like this, this masculine's gone quiet, which has made you maybe think that, you know, that he's not interested. Um, but I think ultimately he, he is interested and he's doing a lot of work behind the scenes. Oh, confirmation, but <laughs> photograph, looking at your photographs, nostalgia, making new memories, missing you. What else is this masculine feeling towards the divine feminine police spirit? And I saw lightning on the bottom of the pack there as well. I forgot to mention. Uh, which talks about, you know, things coming in fast. They were lively. Okay, so cassette, outdated thinking, conditioning, replaying events over and over in your head. So I do feel he's reminiscing quite a lot about you and thinking about things. Oh, look, lightning is on the bottom of the pack again. That's ridiculous. So sudden change, shocking news, surprise, epiphany, and upheaval. We've also got separation. Kind of came out in reverse. So, but again, this is about sadness, missing you, thinking about you, yearning, unsure of future. But I, so I feel a little bit like he he he's look, working to end this separation, okay. And when it happens, I feel like it's going to happen quite fast. Um, what would this divine masculine like to say to you if he can message you? What would this divine masculine like to say if he did break no contact? What would this divine masculine like to say if he did break no contact? What would this masculine say if he broke no contact? Spirit? I can't stop thinking about you. I feel you even though we're apart. I wish I could share my good news with you on the bottom of the page. And I feel this is like he is building an empire at the moment. Like he's doing new things, um, trying to become a better person. I want to feel that way again on the bottom of the pack. Um, my life is not as together as it seems and so many things remind me of you. I feel like he is working on himself at the moment to kind of get things in together so he can come with a tangible offer for you. House, um, work, um, you know. Look how you're feeling. How is the Divine Feminine feeling about her masculine at the moment? Oh, coffin. Oh, Jesus. Endings bring new beginnings, growth, change, liberation, transition. Yeah, I do feel like you've gone, I'm done. And uh, I feel like I'm part of this collective. So it's kind of nice to see um, that there's probably change coming. But again, don't get, don't, just because he's doing stuff, it doesn't mean you need to do stuff, okay? Um, remember, you're the feminine. Okay, looking at your photos, missing you. So you're both missing each other. Um, I feel like the divine feminine has disconnected for her own mental health. Boat, receiving what you need, progression, arriving, moving on, closure issues, yeah. So I feel the feminine is focusing on healing herself at the moment, withdrawing all of her energy from the masculine so that she can focus on herself. And also because it kind of makes you a little bit insane, I think, um, sometimes. But I think for that divine masculine who has re retracted herself from his life, um, there is a there is, he's still he's still interested. Um, he is working on himself. That's why he's quiet. Um, you know, there's, um, there's love here. Um, he is hoping for a fresh start. He's working on himself and he wants to come as the Ten of Pentacles, you know, and as the Emperor so he can actually be what he needs to be for you. And I just split to the Ten of Cups again. It, I feel like there's going to be a happy ending here. So I just think, don't worry about it. Keep focusing on you. Um, yeah, communication coming in. 
Um, keep focusing on you. And I think when this communication comes, you need to be super honest about how you feel, Divine Feminine, to make sure this moves forward.